JMU, known as the Dragons. The symbolic representation of fear, passed down through generations, biblical, mythological, epics. We are the representation of what must be overcome. I said, why did you start playing volleyball, bro? Um, I just thought it was really interesting. I started playing volleyball because of an anime and uh, I watched, uh, it was Haikyuu. Uh, <laughs> and volleyball because of the anime, you know, Haikyuu play. So, yeah, I watched that couple of episodes. I was like, you know what, maybe I should try to sport. I wanted to play something new and being in my final year, I wanted to, you know, compete and, you know, do some fun fun. So this is our first training session, but and our first one with a coach. Um, we never, we didn't have one after this. Definitely showed um, when we played games, but this training session was very good. Yeah, we got to learn how to pass properly and keep it controlled. This was just a little competition we had at the end of the training session uh, and then the highest points wins um, with a punishment at the end but uh, we kind of ran out of time in the gym so we just had to leave. Loughborough was a tough game. Uh, it was our first cup game of the season. Um, yeah, and they were the they were the league above us. I know Loughborough's known for their sports and stuff, so it was a lot of pressure on my dude. Are you ready, boys? Oh, I got it. had really good serves, really good blocks. because most of the points we got came from their mistakes.
I got a really nice dig which ended up into that court and I got a point which was pretty damn cool. There was, there, was, there was no blocks. There was a couple of blocks from from myself, but um, nothing killable. Uh, especially their last point to win in the first set. It came off the hands, kept thinking, and just I was like, I was angry at myself. I didn't really feel like I played that wild, to be honest. And now uh, I was, I ended up getting swapped to play middle blocker, which annoyed me a little bit. Uh, yeah, it just wasn't wasn't a great team morale, um, and you can see that in the mistakes we were making. Clients a lot for other, yeah, and better perform. You know, got a couple blocks. It's kind of feel like you know. Especially because, like, the outside was, like, pretty strong. And he's not even on the annual was playing first team as well, so it was kind of tough, but I stepped up to see. We were always kind of behind, behind Loughborough, and, you know, we were really trying, like, really fight back. Sometimes we would get the points, but you know, like in the second set, we were still trying to battle it out, but it was difficult. I think the difference was between Lachro and us was definitely technique. And you can kind of tell by like our run-ups to, to do the spikes and you know, our blocking and you know, all our technique was kind of not there um, compared to Lachro. just felt that game really highlighted that, you know, we, we were really inexperienced. The third and final set was a complete abomination. You know, we were up here in the first set, the second set, third. It was gone. Uh, all our mistakes, we just gave up. We then changed positions again. Uh, we had a third middle blocker, uh, just like kind of stand in. Um, so you can still tell at this point, we didn't know what our team was. We didn't know our starting six. We did not, or starting seven. We did not know it. 
our whole team morale was in the bin. You could kind of tell that our morale was really down, like people on the squad point, we didn't really celebrate at all. Halfway through the third set, we started to try and find our ground and we started getting some points. But it was way too late in the game for any kind of comeback. This was a full setup. Uh, the game just kept on going, and it was actually a really good game. I know, speaking for myself, I got overly excited. I kind of want to play World Cup at Perthing, yeah. So if you know the Jordan Fuller pick, just very quick.